hey what's going on guys let's look at this problem right here here this question is asking find the concentration of holes and of electrons in p type germanium at 300 degree kelvin if the conductivity is 100 ohm centimeter power minus one okay so here we are going to find out the concentration of holes and of electrons okay and also they are mentioning this is a p type semiconductor whenever we have p type semiconductor the majority is going to be holes and the minority is going to be electrons so the conductivity equation we have to use is in, in terms of holes because compared to holes the electrons can be neglected so we can use the holes conductivity equation that's going to be equal to p rho actually pq mu p okay now p is what we are trying to find and the conductivity is given that's 100 ohm centimeter power minus one so we can put 100 for this one we are trying to find p and the charge of the electron is 1.6 times charge of charge is going to be same value q is going to be same value for hole or electron so 1.6 times 10 to the power of minus 19 and then mu p we have to assume that is 1800 centimeter square per volt second in 300 degree kelvin okay so this is going to be 1800 and if we rearrange this equation we are going to have p is equal to 10 to the power of 19 divided by 1.6 times 18 because we cancel these two zeros in that way we can bring this like this i brought this one to this side in that way i got the 10 to the power of minus 19 move from denominator to the i mean denominator to the numerator so we got plus 19 and the other two went to denominator okay now if we simplify this one this is going to be what 10 to the power of 20 we can get rid of this decimal so this is going to be 16 times 18 i put a one one power to the numerator and then we can write this one as thousand times 288 if you multiply this one 288 times 10 to the power of 17 and that's going to give us 3.47 times 10 to the power of 17 per centimeter cube so this is going to be holes concentration now majority is holes minor actually majority is holes minority is electrons so to find the minority concentration we had to use the mass action law that's given by n is equal to n i square divided by n a or you can say p p is the major we have to divide this one by majority concentration that's what we found right here so n i square is intrinsic concentration that's given that is 2.5 times 10 to the power of 13 for germanium right so we had used that one 2.5 times 10 to the power of 13 square divided by 3.47 that's the majority concentration 3.47 times 10 to the power of 17 equal to 6.25 you square this one this is going to give us 6.25 divided by 3.47 and we have the powers the top power is going to be 10 to the power of 13 square that's going to become 10 to the power of 26 divided by 10 to the power of 17 finally if we simplify this one that's going to give us 1.8 times 10 to the power of 9 electrons per centimeter cube so this is going to be the electron concentration and that's how we do this kind of problems i hope this helps thanks for watching